Hey guys, this is Steve Huff from stevehuffphoto.com. Uh, being a reviewer for the last 10, 11 years, having a YouTube channel for a long time and reviewing some weird stuff here from time to time, I get sent quite a bit of stuff to review. So here's an example of what I'm talking about. How about this beginner drone? It is the X5UW, perfect for beginners. Very inexpensive, a fun little drone. I'm gonna test this in the next few days. Or how about a more serious drone, which I've spoken about already. This is a this is my favorite drone right here. Even things like this, this wireless iPhone charger and little uh, or office organizer. I even get cases sent to me, this iPhone 10 power case right here. How about these things? These are some meditation goggles. Casino Mind Place goggles. Whoa. How about this Joby Gorilla Pod right here? This is like a crazy one. Or even this Leica tabletop tripod that still has the same design from like ages ago. Lens adapters, lenses like this Voigtlander 35 F12, lava lamps. How about this record cleaner that looks like a Gillette shaver? This big guy is the Wotencraft Commander Bag. And it's commanding the entire frame of this screen right now. So I'm wearing the Wotencraft Commander backpack right now. It's big, it's beastly, it's massive, but if you know Wotencraft and you like Wotencraft, then you know the quality of construction that goes into their bags. You can see it on my back right here. And I have it full of some gear. I have a Canon 1DX Mark II in here, a couple of lenses, I had a microphone, a 6D Mark II, 16 to 35 lens. Uh, some accessories, ND filters, all in this bag. And right now it feels really well balanced. It's not heavy, um, it feels really good. Wotencraft always uses premium materials. So this bag is not cheap. It's gonna set you back around $700. I believe it's $699. So let's take a look inside the bag real quick. This thing looks bigger than me. Wotencraft Commander Debbie. Okay, so let's take a look at this bag from Wotencraft. It consists of pretty much weatherproof canvas, leather accents, you have leather straps, you have uh, high quality everything. So no expense has been spared on making this bag. The same with any Wotencraft bag. Now Wotencraft is my favorite bag manufacturer of all time. I own several of their bags. Um, for my cameras, but this is on another level. This is not something I would normally use. I'm normally just a bag with a camera and two lenses, and these cicadas are all over the place, so they're a little loud. But this bag is if you're traveling, it's perfect for that. If you're out on a hike, if you're doing a photo adventure, this bag will hold anything you need. Now, it comes with all kinds of dividers, and in here, in the bottom pocket, I have room for two of these guys, actually, if I wanted. So I had the 1DX inside there, and it just slides right in. And if I had another one, I can slide a second one right in. You have a huge, I don't have dividers in there right now, but you have a huge hole, a huge chasm in there where you can store all kinds of gear. If you put the dividers in, you could literally put two DSLR size cameras in the bottom. So that's perfect for those with a lot of gear, perfect for those long travels. Up here you have another pocket. What do I have in here? Oh, I have a little bracket in here that holds my display and my mic for the 1DX. That's what I have in there. If we go to the back, you can see the pretty uh, extravagant strap system. This is all super high quality leather, padded uh, shoulder pads here so your shoulders stay comfortable. But this leather is like superb quality. You got high quality zippers here. You can put in folders, you can put an iPad in here into the side. So you have plenty of space there. Um, we go on, there's pockets right here. 
we go on to the front of the bag, here you have another pocket that you can hold um, whatever you like. I had held my Rode VideoMic Pro Plus in that front pocket. You also have another side pocket here. What do I have in here? I have a battery for the 6D Mark II and I have an ND filter for uh, one of the lenses I have here. So you have more pockets, they're just everywhere. So you have storage everywhere on this bag. Again, this goes into the big bottom storage where you put your cameras, but up top you have this flap which protects the top. As with most Wotencraft bags, these can connect right here and stay sealed protects your gear from rain. You open that up and you still have more protection. You have a zipper top right here. Open that up and then you have a flap that protects it even more. What do I have in here? I have um, a 24 1.4 lens. What else do I have? I have a Canon M50 camera with a lens and then I have a small HD monitor display which goes on my 1DX. Um, so this bag holds a ton of gear. I could hold so much more gear in here than I currently am. Um, so it's actually too much bag for me. I'll use it when I travel or go on, again, long photo journeys or if I do a workshop anytime coming up, I will bring this bag. The one thing that's clear though with Wotencraft and I've had bags for many years from them. They stand the test of time, they last, they don't wear out. The quality is about as good as it gets. So this is one of those cases where you do get what you pay for. They're not cheap, this bag is around $700. And you can check out more at the website for Wotencraft. I'll link that in the description below.